radiyallahu anha, Asiya alayhi salam. Asiya, the wife of Fir'aun. Her husband Fir'aun, where is he? And where is she when the Prophet ﷺ mentioned her to be from the women whose Iman was kamil, complete, full? SubhanAllah. It was perfect. So if you look at Asiya radiallahu anha, you look at the situation of her husband Fir'aun in the lowest part of the fire and leading his people into the fire Yawm Qiyamah and all of the, the things that he did. But that's just an extreme example. In reality, there are many women who are far above their husbands in the sight of Allah Azza wa But when you live only for this dunya and you only care about this dunya, then you only care about what rights you have in this dunya. I only care about, am I in charge? Am I the one making the decisions? Am I the one that has the most power, the most authority? Am I the one that has the most flexibility? That's all you care about because it's only the dunya. That's the only thing they say. وَمَا هِيَ إِلَّا حَيَاتُنَا الدُّنْيَا نَمُوتُ وَنَحْيَا وَمَا يُهْلِكُنَا إِلَّا الدَّهْرِ It's only this life of this world, we live and we die, and it's just the passage of time. Nothing kills us except time. Nothing causes us to die except time. That's what these people believe. And so they lose this concept of accepting what Allah gave you and realizing that what Allah has given to a wife doesn't stop her from being above her husband, Yawm Al-Qiyamah, Darajat, many levels. And what Allah has given to the husband doesn't stop him from being above his wife, Darajat, Yawm Al-Qiyamah, many levels.